nutrition is obviously a massively important part of how you effectively and happily pedal your way from London to Paris. I'm always about keeping it simple, keeping it as natural as possible. So if you do resort to sports nutrition, be that you know gels or bars, make sure it's things that you've tried ahead of time. You know what it's like, you know your gut will happily accept. There's nothing worse than being on a big ride and getting a funny tummy. The one thing you absolutely do need to have and get used to is electrolytes. You know, a drink which has some salt and sugar balances in it, so as you sweat that out, you're putting it back in. Because the better hydrated you are, the more effective your gut wall is at taking in that food. Um, you don't need to worry overly about upping the amount of food you need. Being in shape ahead of time obviously helps, thinking about your nutrition for the, the couple of months in the lead-in, be as trim as you can be, try and cut down on your alcohol intake, but you don't need to think about big meals to fuel yourself. You want to stay light, you want to be fueling little amounts regularly. And as you start doing longer training rides, just getting used to that. Every hour, hour and a half, having something to keep yourself going mentally and physically, that stops any big peaks and troughs in how you're feeling.